very much, and uh, it, it makes me extremely happy today to be introducing this bill calling on the government to establish a national strategy for eye care, something that has been talked about as far back as 2003 and 4, and uh, talked about as many things, and it takes a long time before maybe things will end up in reality. And I'm hoping as a result of my private member's bill today that it will help to move this issue along. There are over uh, 8 million people suffering from blindness disease, and it can grow to expect it uh, to be over 14 million. And I would say that for all of us who have family or friends or ourselves in the future that are suffering from uh, eye disease, uh, it's terrible to lose your sight. And the social impact that it has on people, as well as all of the parts that go along to how it affects people's lives. And when we're talking about being a proud country that wants to ensure that Canadians have access to good health, well, once you lose your eyesight, so many, many other things change. And that's your ability to get around, your ability to socialize, your ability to work, and so many other things. So as we work and move forward to with a national pharma care program, a dental program, a natural, of course, would be an eye program. And that's why I'm calling on this today. Uh, I've seen blindness. My grandmother was totally blind when she died. She'd been blind for about 20 years. And I now have my dear aunt, uh, who's blind, and my mentor for many years, Mr. Paul Valenti, uh, also died of blindness. So there's many people being affected, and I'm hoping that as a result, in fact, I know as a result of this bill and the work that we will do to push it forward, we have the support of so many organizations across Canada, uh, we will work together to ensure that by the fall, we get this uh, through the House and through the Senate, because there's a lot of people who want to support it, and I look forward to a successful uh, bill being passed as we continue to move forward. Um, we also have Jim Prouse from the Canadian Council for Blindness with us as well that will say a few words. Go ahead, oh, Jim. Thank you. Well, I think you've, you've explained our thoughts on vision loss uh, very well. And thank you for your members, Bill. And I think this is a major step that ourselves at the Canadian Council of the Blind, Fighting Blindness Canada, and the CAO, and the Canadian Association of Ophthalmologists are, have all been working for and hope that we can move forward into the future for uh, better attention uh, with a national health strategy, uh, a vision health desk, and increase investment on vision health research funding. These are all major steps that uh, we've been looking forward to, and this is a, a huge step forward, and I thank you for all your efforts and work in working towards this and putting this bill forward. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Jim. All right, um, we'll open the floor if there are any questions. Uh, if there are any questions, I don't see anyone waiting in the queue. Um, does anyone have any questions? Y a-t-il des questions? Appears not. Thank you very much. Thank you. Census News Conference. Thank you very much.